Hey there guys, this is Raj here. Friends, today I'm going to talk about uh, Alix. Uh, I'm having a bit of a toothache. It's pretty nasty. So I'm a bit haggard today, but I'm going to try and finish this off because we promised to have two videos every week. Uh, this is the second one. Uh, and um, Alix is collaborating with Gilead, as you know, and together they are trying to come up with what is called as the Shock and Kill Initiative. And we have some good news. Of course, this is not latest news, but we got this news somewhere on February of 2023. I'm just packaging it all together for you and presenting it here so that you can break through the monotony of just talking about B and ABs. So let's get started. Welcome back, friends. A closer look at the Alix and uh, Gilead's initiative approaches the pursuit of an HIV cure, which has long been a challenging yet hopeful journey for many companies and uh, academic institutions worldwide. With the advent of new tools, improved understanding and faster technologies, the landscape of HIV research is evolving rapidly. Today we are closer than ever to finding a cure. One of the promising advances in the field comes from the collaborative efforts between Alix Therapeutics, which is a Barcelona-based company, and Gilead Sciences, focusing on innovative strategies such as shock and kill approach. Pioneering HIV vaccine development uh, from Alix uh, Therapeutics, which is a clinical stage biotechnology company uh, and which is at the forefront of developing immunotherapies for HIV, has brought to us their unique proprietary HDI uh, immunogen sequence, which is designed to be delivered to the body using multiple viral and non-viral vectors. This uh, in innovative approach aims to enhance the immune uh, system's ability to target and control HIV. The ALIX002 trial, which began in September 2017, marked the company's first clinical trial. This phase one randomized double-blind placebo-controlled study evaluated the safety, tolerability, and immunogenicity of the HDI vaccine in early diagnosed, early treated HIV-infected individuals. The trial utilized a heterologous uh, prime boost vaccination regimen involving DNA plasmids, MVA, which is modified virus Ankara uh, vector, and uh, chimpanzee adenovirus vectors, so different vectors carrying the payload, were sent into the body. Initial results showed promise, leading to an expansion of the study to include more participants. Building on this success, Alix announced a clinical collaboration with Gilead Sciences in October 2018. This led to the Alix 003 trial, which explored the combination of Alix HDI vaccine and Gilead's TLR7 agonist, Vesatolimod, which is GS9620. This study aimed to assess the safety, tolerability, and immunogenicity of the combination in 57 participants across 10 sites in Spain. The trial's data expected in late 2022 has now been revealed, showing encouraging results. Uh, I think uh, somewhere around February 23, 2023 is when we got those results. And the shock and kill strategy from Gilead Sciences and uh, Alix uh, is kind of a new approach uh, and uh, that targets the dormant HIV reservoirs within the body. And this method involves using agents to shock the latent virus out of its reservoirs, making it visible and vulnerable to subsequent killing by antiretroviral therapies. In their collaboration with Alix, Gilead's investigational drug Visatilimod uh, plays a cru crucial role because it's a toll-like receptor or TLR7 agonist uh, that activates the dormant HIV, allowing the immune system boosted by Alix HDI vaccine to target and eliminate the virus. This combination has shown promising results in ALIX-003 trial, suggesting a potential path towards viral remission. The ALIX-003 trial evaluated the combination of HDI vaccine and the TLR7 agonist from Gilead in early treated HIV-infected uh, individuals, and the trial's primary and secondary endpoints for safety, tolerability, and immunogenicity were successfully met, and participants underwent an ATI, or analytical treatment interruption phase, where their antiretroviral therapy was paused for up to 24 weeks and during this period the plasma viral load was monitored weekly. Results indicated that a higher proportion of H HDI plus VES treated participants remained off ART for full 24 weeks demonstrating the potential of this combination to modulate HIV specific immune responses and achieve better viral control without continuous ART. 
The immune data revealed high levels of HTI-specific T cell responses with vesatolimod uh, consi uh, consistently in inducing a pharmacodynamic response in combination therapy. Dr. Ch Christian Brander, who is the chief scientific officer of Helix, uh, highlighted the significance of these findings, noting that the HTI vaccine aims to refocus the immune response on particular vulnerable sites of HIV. The trial confirmed the potential of the HTI vaccine in extending the time of ART, aligning, aligning with previous observations from ALIX002 study. And if looking forward to the path forward, there is hope for a HIV cure. The collaboration between ALIX and Gilead represents a significant step forward in the quest for a HIV cure. Note the word cure. We are talking about cure here. The positive outcomes from ALIX003 trial provides a strong foundation for future research and development with continued advancements in understanding HIV and utilizing cutting edge technologies. The vision of achieving viral remission and ultimately eradicating HIV is becoming increasingly attainable. As we celebrate these milestones, the commitment of companies like Alix and Gilead, uh, along with the support of scientific community, brings renewed hope to millions of people living with HIV. And the journey towards a HIV cure is complex, but with innovative approaches and collaborative efforts, a future free of HIV seems to be within reach. The light at the end of the tunnel is visible because there are many such initiatives which are really powerful and more dynamic than anything attempted in the past. With that, my friends, I would like to end this video and I would like to suggest that stay optimistic, stay hopeful, enjoy your weekend and I'll catch up with you again in the next weekend. If you, are, uh, if you like the contents in this channel, please do not hesitate to press a like on the video because it helps the channel with the algorithms. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe. And if you have any friends who would like to have this kind of information, please send them a link to our channel and request them to subscribe to our channel and push us to our goal of 20,000 subscribers. With that, my friends, I'd like to end this video here. Thanks and have a great day. Bye for now.